Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is our first full day aboard the Disney Magic, but in a surprise twist it is actually not Marvel Day at Sea today. So we are going to be heading out in a minute, we are going to Rapunzel's for breakfast, and then we're just going to kind of see which activities are on throughout the day. We do know that at 11.45 there is the Lion King trivia, which we haven't done yet and we are very very excited for. So make sure to stay tuned for that and everything else that we get up to today. <laughs> Quarter past nine, we are eating at Rapunzel's and there's a queue of about four or five families in front of us. We walked past Lumiere's though and there was about like 20 or more families. So if you do go for breakfast like after about half eight, be prepared to have to queue for a while because I think it gets very, very busy at that point. So we've just gotten some fruit to start. They said that basically that it's been really busy today so the wait's quite long. So we just got some like fruit platters to begin with. So this is the southern hash with scrambled eggs. It's basically like potatoes, eggs, some like veg and chorizo. This is literally just scrambled eggs and hash browns and this is somehow what I've ended up with. A massive omelette which is obviously like a plant based omelette with mushrooms, spinach and onions and maybe peppers. I've got four hash browns somehow, two massive plant based sausages and the biggest bowl you've ever seen of guacamole which is actually so crazy. We are now at Lion King Trivia, so it'll be interesting to see how this goes. We got 16 out of 20. We, we don't think 20. we'll win because it was a multiple choice, well but we'll did. see. 10 or more. I love it. Alright, we're going to jump up 12 or more. Alright, we lost a few. The roar is getting a bit quieter now, but it's okay. If we got 15 or more. We're doing good. Oh, no, we're doing very good. 17 or more. Did any, did any, is anyone's hand still up? 16 or more. All right, so we have oh one, two, three, four teams with 16 out of 20. So those four teams that have got 16 out of 20, I want to know. Um, the answer was 88. We came second. There. Somebody else put 93. So, so that's pretty good. now at Fathoms for Brain Teasers Trivia, which we haven't done yet, we don't know what it's all about, but it'll be interesting to see how we do in this. We have smashed this 14 Hello, out of 15. It's all basically trivia. riddles, but it's yeah. actually pretty good. 14 or more. Okay, we've lost a few more. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, don't know how that's possible, but yes, can anyone beat 15? Or anyone join 15? No. Then these are the winners right here. Give them a round of applause. Well done, team. That was hard as well, so well done. We are now headed to Lumiere's for lunch. So apparently uh, Lumiere's shuts at quarter past one. We did not know that. It's half past one now. It's actually 20 to two. So we're having to go to Cabanas, but obviously in Cabanas being vegan is not great. So we've asked them and they said they're gonna send an impossible burger to Cabanas for us. And then obviously the others can just get whatever they want. But that's just something to bear in mind. If you go later for lunch, it's probably only gonna be Cabanas that's open. Try and get there before like one o'clock if you do want to go to one of the restaurants. Okay, so there's some dolphins just outside. I don't know if one's gonna jump five. out. Did there's five, the no. I wanna see if they jump out again. They will. Did you see it? There's one. There we go. There they are. That's amazing. So we've literally got here about 30 seconds ago and they've already somehow made it and brought it up for us. Like that is absolutely amazing. So the others are just grabbing their food. But I now have this, which is exactly what I wanted. Okay, we have some dessert. So we have a strawberry oh, I tart. Love it. I love the I know. Is that like I a know. custard swan? He says it. Meal fei. Okay. And what's that other one? Panacotta. That's like key lime pie. We've also just asked for some allergy cookies and these are the ones they gave us. If you watch my other vlogs, we've had different allergy cookies. But I think this is actually the same as the ones I had with my dessert last night, which was like the apple with like coconut ice cream. So these look really good. We are now back in the promenade lounge for Disney trivia. We've checked to make sure it's not one we've done before. So hopefully this will be a new win for us today. This was not our quiz. We've got no answers for half of them. And most of the rest are guesses. This is not going well. 
we got 14 and a half out of 25. Considering how badly it went, I'll take it. There's a lot of panels. Goofy's going to be counting for a while. I think there's a few more than four, Donald. A few more than four. So again, let me take a look again. So we are now headed to D Lounge for Sar Sarge Says. We haven't done this yet, so we don't actually know what it's all about. We had a peak last time, but we didn't actually watch it. If I say Sarge says, if I say Sarge says, mm -hmm, then you, mm -hmm, get it? Sarge says, present arms. <laughs> Sarge says, present legs. Look at that guy at the back. <laughs> Sarge says, present elbows. To the rear. I didn't say Sarge says. Oh. Sarge says, are you ready? Oh, yes, Sarge. And commence. Sarge says, dance. <laughs> Sarge says, freeze. Ooh, we'll call that one a warm up round. Sarge says, continue. So it was actually pretty fun. It's definitely aimed at kids, but. There was other people with just adults there and it was pretty fun so I would recommend going to it if you've got an extra bit of time for it. We are now going to play a little bit of shuffleboard, our new favourite activity. Well there's four choices, so last time we played one of the sticks was dodgy and one was good. That's pointy. Oh, it looks pointy. The pointy one's bad, the flat one's good. <gasps> oh! That is rude. We are now headed back to the D lounge for some more Disney trivia. Although it's closed right now, so I don't know about that. It's just not open yet. We're a bit early. So it turns out we've done that quiz before, so we decided we would leave. Um, we are now just going back to the room to get ready for Tangled the Musical. It is very, very full in here. There's still about 10 to 15 minutes to go, and it's pretty much full, so I would definitely advise arriving early if you want a good seat. I've said it before, but I'll say it again. If you are going on a cruise and you're only gonna do one thing the whole time, go and watch Tangled. It is amazing. It's one of the best shows I've ever seen. I would literally recommend it to anybody. So if you are going on a cruise, make sure to go and watch that. We are now gonna head down and go and watch Top Hits by Anna Bakalova on the violin, which is super, super nice. We've watched it a few times. We're just gonna head down there and play cards a bit before tea. And then we are headed to Animator's Palette tonight for our dinner. <laughs> Okay, so we've just sat down, we're getting ready to draw our animations for today. It, this is probably, most likely, the last time I'm going to do it and I'm actually going to make it good today. It's going to have a normal sized head and normal sized hands, hopefully. So I'm basically an artist now, is what we've established here. I mean, look at this. Go back and watch the first time we went to Animator's Palette and then look at this beauty. I might even put a screenshot in if I can find it and you will see I have greatly improved. It's definitely still a little bit dodgy and if you're actually good at art, then you know, maybe not. 
but for me this is really pretty good so these are the starters this is the tomato tart i'm assuming this is the ham with ham. olive ciabatta or something yeah it looks and like cheese cheese and this is a made up kind of starter it's white and green asparagus with radishes potatoes and rocket i'll be back later but right now we invite you to sit back and relax as the dining room proudly presents your dinner chicken with mashed potato and root vegetables and then me and Zeb have both gone for the bean cakes which I definitely recommend they are very nice. So this is the chocolate fudge cheesecake. It looks different. I swear they used to be square. This is the cookies and cream sundae and this is off the kids menu. It is a white chocolate white chocolate cheesecake and then this is the red wine poached pear and then i'm assuming raspberry or strawberry sorbet with a little cookie underneath also our drinks waiter g'day made us this origami frog which is so cool i'm not very good at making it jump though he made it jump yeah he did make it jump <laughs> That's what to do when you can't draw. That's actually a good idea. There's me on the end. That's this side. That's me. That's Rach and Debbie in the middle. The one on the left is Debbie, and the one on the right is Rach. Okay, we are now back at the room very, very quickly. Here is our animal of the day, it's a bear. Tonight we are heading for pub quiz, unless it's one we've already done. We are then going for seriously, which we don't know what it is because it should be something that it's not. And then it's crazy karaoke, which is adults only karaoke, which we haven't done yet. So we are very, very excited to go and see what that's all about. 25 general knowledge questions. And it's basically is what it says on the tin. I'm going to ask you the questions and you have to answer them. We got oh 13 out of 25. Did anybody get higher than 12? Yes. 13? We've got 13. 13. 13. Oh, <laughs> We're so excited. Oh, oh, they got 14. 14. Oh. 14 and a half. Oh. Don't think so. <laughs> okay, did anybody beat 14? We have got seriously, first up, ooh, seriously, and then coming up after that, we have none other than crazy karaoke. Well, hopefully some of you are, because we're going to need some singers for our crazy karaoke. All right, so for seriously, we're going to split the room in half. We're going to have two teams. How this game works is we're going to ask you a random, crazy, wild trivia question. Now, we have three possible answers. One of the answers, David has created. <laughs> Another one, I created. <laughs> and then there's the truth. So, if David's team picks my lie, then my team gets points. So we may or may not have carried karaoke again. This time was way worse than last time because nobody was signing up. So like I think two people went and then after that there was nobody. So me and Rach did You'll Be Back from Hamilton and then directly after still nobody had signed up. So we did Fresh Prince of Bel-Air and then a couple more people signed up and then there was nobody again. So then we did Don't Stop Believing. They just had it on, nobody went up to the front. Everybody just kind of sang it together, which was quite cute. It was a good night, but more people definitely need to volunteer to make it more Fun. Also, people did pick good songs this time. Like, I feel like nobody picked a song that I didn't know, which was quite good. Anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave me a massive thumbs up. And make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the rest of these vlogs coming very, very soon. If you haven't already checked out all the other Disney Cruise Line vlogs I've done in the last few weeks, make sure to go check them out. And other than that, I'll see you next time with a brand new video. Bye!